If I speak with human eloquence and angelic ecstasy, but don't love, I am nothing but the creaking of a rusty gate. If I speak God's word with power, revealing all of his mysteries and making everything plain as day, and if I have the faith that says to a mountain, jump, and it jumps, but I don't love, I am nothing. If I give everything I own to the poor and even go to the stake to be burned as a martyr, but I don't love, I've gotten nowhere. So no matter what I say, what I believe, what I do, I am bankrupt without love. Love never gives up. Love cares for others more than itself. Love doesn't want what it doesn't have. Love doesn't strut. Love doesn't have a swelled head. It doesn't force itself on others. It isn't always me first. It is not easily angered. It doesn't keep score of the sins of others. It doesn't revel when others grovel. It takes pleasure in the flowering of truth. It bears all things. It trusts God always believes for the best, never looks back, and keeps going to the end. But for right now, until that completeness, we have three things to do to lead us toward that consummation. Trust steadily in God, hope unswervingly, love extravagantly, and the best of the three is love. Stop. <laughs> 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 